Love is patient. Love is kind. There is nothing a woman like me wouldn't do to have a taste of what it really feels like to love and be loved in return. Rumi. Naomi! So you didn't hear me calling you? I, I was about to spread these clothes. Naomi! Isn't my breakfast supposed to be a priority to you? I am sorry. Can you stop saying sorry and do the right thing for the first time in your life? I'm sure your mother wants her breakfast too. I'm okay, Dennis. No, oh, let me speak for myself then. I am starving. I need my breakfast now. Now! Suggest such a thing. All right, Dad. I'll do it. It's okay, Dad. I hope it won't become a problem. guest so we prepare the extra room and make it fresh what guest my brother you have a brother yes and I didn't mention it for a good reason so why here why can't he stay my with mother you? will not have him in her house why won't your mother have a son in the house because it's not her son but it's your brother Half brother. So he'll be staying with us until he gets back on his feet. Oh. So your father had an affair, isn't it? You. You would not mention this to anyone. Else I will have you disappear. After all, you've not even done what I married you for. You want to give your husband a have a good day kiss? Come on, that's your mother. She's been staying with us for a long time now, so get about your shyness and give your husband a kiss. you to stay in your room. I'll bring anything you need. I know you are busy. 
and I don't want to trouble you. It's okay. I've taken it. Okay. If you need anything else, let me know, okay? My dear, please forgive me if I'm interfering. But you really should learn not to upset your husband. Dennis is a good man. And you're lucky to have him. Lucky? I don't feel lucky. He has been a wonderful provider and supporter. Imagine what would have become of you if he... <sighs> Your father is gone. And I am down. And as our only child, you will not have anyone to lean on if anything should happen between you and Dennis. Okay. And Mom, I get it. Oh, you do? You said it a thousand times. Ah, uh, and you are still getting him upset at every chance you get. <sighs> Naomi, you are yet to give him a child. Please, don't give him any more reason to be displeased with you. Mom, like I said before, if you need anything, let me know. Okay. You are yet to give him a child in you. Don't give him any more reason to be displaced with you. So many times me I they wonder why I do the people that we claim to love they would be the ones that would hurt us so, so bad. So many times me I don't give up on love. Me I know fear fight this love again. So I am done, done, Yeah, he is. Naomi, my wife. Hi, madam. Hi. Take his bag. Welcome to my humble abode. Thank you. My food! It's um, <laughs> the little place here. Um,
Naomi, what is this? I was coming to... Will you, you stupid? I mean, obviously, you're stupid. How will you leave our guest food to burn? What will he eat? Uh, don't worry, I'm going to prepare another one. You are I'm sorry. Will you shut up? Always saying sorry. And of course, you will prepare another one. Will you not? What is wrong with you? I'm sorry, I'll just quickly... Now then, just get out of my way. Our dinner, your dinner. Oh. She left it to burn. I'm sorry. So, what would you eat now? Nah, it's okay. I'm fine. No, you can't be fine. You must be hungry. Okay, let me just grab the car keys so that we can go out and get dinner. Mm. Okay, that's okay. Mm. Naomi! Naomi! Come down! So you burnt the dinner. Let's go out and get something to eat. Ask your mother what she would eat. Hurry up. Get my car keys. Let's just stop. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Okay? Relax. I'll take care of My brother, he has problems. A lot of problems. That's sad. Many issues. So what do you say if I give you 100,000 to have a good time? Show him what good time is. A good time is what I do best. Really? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I know how to do this thing. Okay. So can you just put your account number? Let me show you how much good time I would want you to give to him. <laughs> All right. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> no, 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 not me. He just give him everything. Make sure that he have excess of good time. Can you do that? <laughs> Come on, go do your job. <laughs> brother, you need to do some help and enjoy it. Enjoy it. Come on. I pay good money for this. I'm not into this kind of stuff. Oh, relax. Come on, come on, loosen up. <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Wait, Maybe you, you want to look here. Look, let's go. You, you can let's keep the money. Let's go. Come on, brother. Come on, come on. Let's come on, go ahead, go ahead. Go yeah. ahead, bro. Bro, Enjoy. come on. Look, Make my money, money count. You can keep the money <laughs> if you want to. No. <laughs> Mm. Excuse me, I want to use the restroom. Oh, okay, go ahead. Mm. You know people can give you your night lap, lap dance? Yes, so can you imagine? Ha! Why now? Pepe, I am not into that kind of stuff. Ha! What's your color, Monisha? Ah, sharp. It's all uncle. I trust you now. I trust you. I trust you. <laughs> Sometimes I said I'm going to be shy, shy. I say I'm not into that kind of stuff.
<laughs> so tell me about it. Did, did you feel like having some more? <laughs> okay, talk to me. Did you enjoy it? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did. Are you sure? It's quite interesting. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was interesting. <laughs> I was I was telling you to go and have fun. You said no, no, but now you enjoyed it. <laughs> Tell me, did he want to make your, you know, want to? Uh, uh, of course he did. Bro, of course bro. he did. He did. Bro. <laughs> this place is full. Mm -hmm. Let me go to the men's toilet. And I'll be back. <laughs> I'll see you. <laughs> you know all liars will go to hell, right? I beg your pardon. Why did you lie to him that you enjoyed it? How did you know about it? I heard everything. I heard the girls talking about it in the restaurant. Look, my brother does not have to know I wasted his money, please. Mm, well, it's fine. Your secret is safe with me. Thank you. You're welcome. Did not order another one? Uh, she have ordered another one. Why? Wow. Why are you busy? I'm in this small tree, yeah? I'm good, I'm good. You sure? Yeah. No. <laughs> it's okay, yeah. Find clean towels and toiletries in the bathroom. You can put your dirty clothes in the laundry basket and wash them in the morning. Ah, no, 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 madam. Sorry, Naomi. I can't let you do my laundry for me. I can handle that and any other thing I can do in the house to support. I mean, to end my stay. That's mm -hmm. not necessary. I can do the house chores alone. Look, I know you can, but I still want to help. That's so kind of you, but I insist. That's not necessary. I can handle it alone. I have to get back to him. All Good right. night. You too. Good night. <clears throat> Whoa. She's so fine.
No, stop. No, 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 stop. How can you have cake? No, stop. This is the way you know. I said, stop. This is what you said the last time. Oh, stop it! Stop. Why? Huh? Why will I stop? Why? I want to have sex with my wife, and that is okay. Huh? It is okay. I said, stop! I will not stop. You are drunk. Your brother is right next door. I do not. Where is the pulpit right next door? I want to have sex with my wife. Huh? That is the only way to make babies. Huh? Uh, not tonight, please. You have been saying not tonight, not tonight for the past few months. Well, this night could as well be the night. Stop hmm? being all tight and let us do this. I am embarrassed. You are embarrassed. You are. You know, the only thing embarrassing here is that my wife cannot conceive and produce a child. That's the main thing to say to her. Just a silly habit I picked up from always being bored and doing nothing but work. You hate it, don't you? Smokers are liable to die young. Mm. And you don't want me to die young? I don't. Mm. Why? Your family. And mm. I would advise you not to allow your brother to see you like this. He doesn't like it. Else he's going to embarrass you. He's so good at it. Embarrassing people? Huh, like his life depends on it. Hmm. Okay. Well, thanks for the heads up. You're welcome. Yep. You refused to tell me your age in the car. You're not going to give up until I tell you, in it. Of course. Okay. I am 25, and you? Whoa, 25. Mm -hmm. You look younger and way prettier for your age. Thank you so much. Mm. Yours? I'm 28. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I mean, that is the part where you're supposed to tell me I look younger and incredibly handsome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're funny. For thinking that I am incredibly handsome? You're handsome and funny. I have to go now before he starts looking for me and bring the entire neighborhood down. Neighborhood? Mm, you've not seen anything. <laughs> good night. All right, good night, madam. Hmm. 
So, um, how long do you plan on staying? Mm. Not for long, or until I at least get a decent job. Dad said that mom's company is hiring. Do you want me to? <laughs> you know this story. I mean, she won't even let me come close. Not to talk about hiring me. Mm. Yeah. Now I could speak to some of my friends or look for a space in Dad's company. It's um it's something. Look, brother, stop worrying yourself. I mean, I will find a job for myself. Mm. Mm -hmm. Sure you can. Let's go for breakfast, yeah. Okay. Be, sir. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Naomi! Naomi, where is the breakfast now? Naomi, do you enjoy me shouting? Eh? This thing... What is this? How many times have I warned you not to allow my toast burn? Burn? But it's not... It's not what? No, I'm, I'm stupid. I'm blind now. I don't know what I'm saying. Eh? You are looking at burnt toast here. You are, you are telling me burnt what? It's okay. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Uh -uh. You don't do anything right in this house. You just want me to shout. You just enjoy me shouting. Dennis, there's really nothing wrong with the toast. Come on. Joshua, if you want to stay here long, do not interfere. Stay out of our business. Do you understand? All right. I'm sorry. Better be. Sure. Naomi. Why do you choose to stab me? So many times no, me I wonder why eh? I do Is the it people that until I shout, you are not satisfied? Or you enjoy that would hurt it? No, no, so, what is this? So bad. If you're fixing it, so fix it fast, though. So many times me, I don't give no, up on no, love. No, it me, can I be this morning. May I not fight this love again. So I am done, done, done. I told you before that my wife has an appointment. Yes, with the family doctor. She cannot do the commercial riders. No. All right. It's fine. I can cancel the appointment. No, you can't. Okay, you need to run that appointment. Let's understand why it is delaying for you to conceive. Okay. But I can use Uber, like the person on phone said. No, you will not. There are other cars. She can take one. She doesn't drive. She doesn't drive or she can't drive. Look, I can take her. I ain't not supposed to be looking for a job. The thing is that I have few places I need to drop off my CV this afternoon. So, I mean, I can take her alongside since I'm going out. Mm -hmm. Fine.
how did the test go? Good. That means it will eventually happen, right? Sure. Your husband, did he have one of those spam tests? Please, I don't want us to talk about this conversation. I'm sorry. Please, I would like you to drop me at the pharmacy, the one close to the exit junction. Okay. How did you two meet? Your husband and I? Yes. It's a long sad story. A sad story? Yes. And I would rather not talk about it. Hmm, of course. I am sure you have your reason for that. So many times me I they wonder why I do the people that we claim to love They would be the ones that would hurt us so, so bad So yeah, many right times back. me I don't give up no. on love Should I come Me I no fear no. fight this love fine. again So I am done, done, done get what you want for Yes. Thank you. Thank you are you. good to go? They find any blockage? Uh, please, I I don't think we should have this conversation over dinner. Can't get me more water. You seem to be getting along well with your brother in law. He seems to be a nice young man. He is. Much younger than Dennis. Huh? And different from him, too. <sighs> Mama, just say what you want to say and stop throwing him to her. I couldn't help but to notice the look on your faces at the table. Naomi. 
I know you are sacrificing a lot for your marriage. It will only be worth it when you finally have a child for him. Okay? Good night, Ma. Good night, dear. Do you want us to have an air without this? That's the process. Uh, I, I, I want to drink, drink water. Oh, you want to drink water? You should have said so. Let me get you water. And, and no, don't, don't worry. I'll, I'll get it. Don't. It's fine. I'll get it. Hurry up. Yes. Calm down. Calm down. She's gone. Is she supposed to be thinking that why she's trying to conceive? There you are. What took you so long? I've been waiting for you. Let's go. So many times me I they wonder why I do the people that we claim to love They would be the ones that would hurt us so, so bad Stop, must we do this? Uh -uh. Don't kill the vibe now, what is your problem? Yes. Uh, okay, 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 okay uh, Just, uh, You don't even need to say okay, this is my right <laughs> So many times, me, I don't give up on love. Me, I don't feel fight this love again. So I am done, done, done. Me, I know feel fight this love again. So I am done, done, done. Who is there? Hi. Come in. Uh, 
did you see the stuff I dropped here? What stuff? The, uh, um, the appeal. I didn't see anything when I came in. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? <laughs> what exactly are you looking for? The appeal. I ran into Dennis when I was coming out from the mm -hmm. kitchen. I didn't want him to see it. So I dropped it here. Did you see it? Oh, no, I didn't see it. I mean, I did not see it. I don't believe you. Come on. Why would I lie if I see it? I don't know. I didn't see it. But why are you taking such pills? I mean, if you're trying to conceive. Please do me a favor. This should be between us, please. Of course. But please, in case you see it, uh, keep it safe for me, please. Thank you. Dr. Deborah, what is she doing here? I'll take my leave. Have a nice day. Dad, I told you that this will happen. He, I, just, I said there was no way he could be able to handle that project without someone in the family supervising it. So what do you intend doing now? One of us? He is not my brother. Dad, how could you even think of involving him in our business? So you're doing that by sending him to supervise a multimillionaire project. It's fine, I'll do it. I'll go to Portacot. This morning, all right, bye. We're traveling to Potato a few days or a week tops. Okay, I'll get your bags packed. Uh, my brother will be going to the family house. Why? I just thought since I am traveling, it will be inappropriate But for... your mother doesn't want him in the house. Hmm. I was just thinking maybe it is um, more comfortable without him here for you. 
Okay, but well, since your mom is here too, I think it's okay. Okay, so I'll just get your bags now. Run on a black suit and these two. Are you not going out to look for work today? Good morning, Ma. It's past eight. And you should be on your way out. Don't you think so? Um. What's going on? I was just telling your brother-in-law that he will be late for his job hunting. Um. Mama, I have an interview for tomorrow, so I'm using today to prepare for it. Since you don't have anywhere to go today, you can keep yourself busy with something else, rather than looking out of the window. All right. I'll get to it, Ma. Better. Your mother is a handful. Indeed. How often do you exercise? Uh, frequent. Why? You look masculine and fit. Is that supposed to be a compliment? It is. Thank you. You are not looking badly either. Are you trying to make me feel good? Oh no, that is the truth. No, that's not the truth. Dennis says otherwise. Really? Yes. And Dennis must be damn out of his mind. <coughs> um, let me quickly go back to what I was doing. Mom, do you need anything? I want to talk to you inside now. Okay, let me quickly finish this. What is wrong with you, Naomi? What did I do? Have you lost your mind? Mom, what did I do? What did you do? She doesn't even see it yet. See what yet? That you're about to ruin your life. Mom, please. If this is about Joshua, he was just trying to remove something from my face. That's all. He is your husband's brother. And when push comes to shove, they will never get rid of their blood. You, on the other hand, is yet to give him a child, meaning you can be replaced at any time. Use your head now. Use your head. That is why God gave it to you.
I'm okay. Okay. Do you want some more? No, no, no. I'm full. Okay. Let me help you with the dishes. Okay. You should stop there. Ma? Sit down. The kitchen is not meant for men. I will help my daughter with the dishes. So go and prepare for your interview tomorrow. Okay, ma. I forgot this mug in my room. Yeah. Do you need your Bible? Yes. Anything else? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, mom. Okay, go in there. Eh? Good night. Good night. All right. What time does your mother go to bed? We could chill at the garden for a while if you feel like chatting. Drop a note in my room if you are down for it, please. Meet me at the garden in two minutes. Be quiet about it. Your mother is really asleep. She can't get out of bed. I removed her walking cane and placed it where she will not be able to reach it. Tell me, why did you refer your story about meeting Dennis as a sad story? Because it is. Do you want to talk about it? No. Okay. I will respect that. Mm. So tell me, why did you turn down the lap dance? I have never heard that any man turned down a lap dance. Really? It's just not my thing. What's your thing? Meeting people, getting to know them before getting intimate. So you're trying to say that you have never had anything to do with a girl without getting to know them first? Mm-hmm. Exactly. Okay. I put it to you. 
You turn down the lap dance because you're in a serious relationship. Mm -mm -mm. No. I'm single. And I'll be single for a while. Getting a lap dance is not something I indulge in. Mm. Mm -hmm. Why are you single? Any particular reason? I... I lost my girlfriend in a car accident two years back. Mm -hmm. And ever since then, I've been single, you know, finding it so difficult to fall in love again. I'm so sorry. You're staring again. And you stare too. But that's only when you stare at me. You leave me no option then <laughs> to reciprocate. You know, from that day I came into this house, I didn't know you would be this cool. Eh? But look at you. You're so cool. Uh -huh. Define cool. Well, my definition of cool would be someone who is um, free spirited and can hold a good conversation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you shouldn't be flirting with her. Mama, I wasn't flirting with her. We were only having a conversation. About what? How to fix Nigeria's economy? <laughs> Listen to me. Your brother must have an amount of trust in you for letting you stay here in his absence. Don't make him regret it. Because the next time I catch you flirting with Naomi, I will tell him. Come on, get out of this place. Nonsense. When did your brother in law leave for his interview? I don't know. What of your husband? Has he called yet? No. Did you call him? No. Ah, ah. Then you're supposed to have called. At least to know if he gets to his destination safely. I'm sure he did. To show a little appreciation to this man for everything he has been doing for us. Now, me. Appreciation? You sold my life to him and his family, and you want me to show appreciation for that? That must be him. Hello? Thank God. I was hoping it would be you. Dennis, good morning. Dennis? Uh, yes, Mama is fine. She's right here at the table. We're just having breakfast. Oh, I'm sure she's right there staring at you. <laughs> now you know. How was your flight? Last night I tried to get your number before she interrupted. Oh, your phone is dead and um, you didn't go with your charger. Uh, okay, do you have a pen and paper? Let me call my number now. Yes. 08133-555-22. All right, I have it. Listen, can you meet me in an hour somewhere? Oh, you want me to pick up something for you? Where? Um, I'll wait for you at the pharmacy before the estate. All right, I'll pick you up from there. Ah, I don't know if I should leave Mama alone. Look, is this you saying no or you are trying to give an excuse not to leave the house? I mean, just find some sleeping pill and putting her tea. Mm, that's not helpful. 
All right, repeat after me. Are you sure there is no other way out? Are you sure there is no other way? No, of course, I wouldn't want to make you feel bad. No, of course, I wouldn't want to make you look bad. Good. Now sigh loudly and agree in that passive aggressive way you do around Dennis. <sighs> oh. Okay, I'll go in an hour. Very good. I'll see you in an hour. Okay, all right, take care. Bye. There's no problem. I'll be going out in an hour to pick up something for Dennis. Dennis left his charger and traveled. It is strange. Mm -hmm. I'm tired. Mm. Yes. Are you done eating? I need to go in and take a nap. Can you finish your food? I'm okay. Oh, wait, let me help you.
I hope I made this thing because the whole thing is looking like a married man. I suspect your mother is awake. Yes. Look, we have to get back inside before she notices that you're not in your room. I'm sure she checks my room before coming out. That means she must have found out that you're not in your room. I don't think so. I put something under my duvet. Ah, you did? Yes. I am done, done, done. Then you came along and stole my heart. Now I'm dancing to the redeem of your heart. Beating so, so bad. In a hopeless place where there's no light and all is gone. All we have now is you and I. We found love. In a hopeless place where there's no light. Do you want rice or swallow? Mm. It's swallow. I want swallow. Vegetable or goosey? Mm. Give me a goosey, but add little vegetable to it. Okay. Mm. Your phone is ringing. Okay. Hello? Yes, my night was good and yours. Okay. Yeah, she's here. Dennis. Uh oh. <clears throat> Dennis, how are you this morning? Yes. We are okay. So, how is Potter Court and what you went there for? Okay. You are staying for one more week. Of course, I will give her. Naomi! Yes, Mom. Come and take somewhere? Uh, yes, I, I'm going to get some groceries. Hello? I already ordered a car, is outside. Waiting. Okay. And don't stay long, okay? No, I won't. See you soon.
Breathing so, so bad In a hopeless place Where there's no light and all is gone All we have now is you and I If I love <laughs> I can't believe we've been here for over five hours. Five hours, okay. Yes, now check I your time. It's not up to that. Come on. Check your time. Jesus Christ. You are right. Mm -hmm. It's 30. Look, we have to start getting home. Your mother must be very worried. <sighs> She'll be all right. Wow, I didn't know time has gone like that. Hmm. How would you know when you have been here cracking me up with your silly jokes? <laughs> My jokes are not silly. Yeah. I tell top-notch jokes. Comedians pay me for me to write for them. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure they do. Because since I got here, I've been laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Naomi, laughter is good medicine. So they say. What? You're staring again. Okay, I'll be okay. You make me happy. Same here. Which is where? How so? For my husband's. Oh, please, don't say it. You know, sometimes I wish you're not. So what would you have done different if I wasn't? A lot of things would have been different. Naomi, you remind me of someone I once loved. Your girlfriend? Yes. You see, both of you share the same nature and calm spirit, which was why I fell in love with her. So you mean you are... Don't say it. Um, before it becomes real. Okay? We have to start going home. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Done with this. I'm sorry I got you worried. You did. What really happened? Hmm. Mama, it was horrible. Huh? A petrol tanker fell in the middle of the road that leads to the modern market. Hey, I hope nobody died. Uh, I heard two people died. Mm -hmm. huh? What a pity. Hmm. Horrible. Hmm. Mama, let me quickly fix dinner. I know you'll be hungry by now. I am famished. I'm mm -hmm. sorry, don't worry. I won't take time. Let's make it snappy. Eh? Yes. <laughs> I see that these two heed my warning. They hardly look at each other lately. It's what is best for Naomi. Do you need anything else? Me with my Bible in there. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you can go in and rest now, okay? All right, Mom. Good night. Thank you. Good night, sir.
Tell me, if you don't love him, why then did you marry him? Hmm? It's a long, sad story. Hmm. So when are you going to tell me this long, sad story? Hmm? You have to stop being uptight to me. Hmm? It's just the two of us here. And I only care about you. That is why I'm asking. He's not picking his call to make it stop. Sleep already. Do you understand? I wouldn't bother myself. Are you talking to Mama? Uh, I was on the phone. The same phone that has been ringing non stop in your room. Mama, I have two phones. Is there anything? Someone has been calling you non stop, and the sound won't allow me to read. So please get the phone. Of course, I'm sorry about that. Mama? What is it? I've been meaning to ask you something. What was that? I don't think it's anything. Hold on. Do it. I told you, Mama, there is nothing. There is nothing here. You really didn't hear that noise. <sighs> Mama, it's, it's nothing. I, I think you should just go get some rest. It's late. Yeah. Let me make sure the doors are properly locked. So what was that you wanted to tell me outside? <sighs> it's late, Mama. Never mind. Just go get some rest.
I thought as much. I can't believe that tomorrow is your birthday. How do you want to celebrate it? I have an idea. It's more of a surprise for you. So prepare and I will pick you up by 4 p.m. right this after work, okay? So, so in a hopeless place where there's no light and all is gone. All we have now is you and I. If I Happy birthday to you once more. So where did you tell her you are going to this time around? To get my medication at the pharmacy. Since I don't know how I have been feeling since morning. Oh, sorry. Thank you. I got you a gift. Open it. Wow. What do you think? It's beautiful. How did you know? I saw you admiring it the other day at the mall. Wow, that's so thoughtful of you. Hmm. I like it, thank you. You're welcome. So, where do you want to eat? Ah, uh, Anywhere, as long as it's with you. Although I would prefer if we buy it and eat it in the car, I don't want anyone seeing us together. Who cares if they see us together? Please, I don't want, I don't want anyone having the impression that, that we are... we're sleeping together. Look, it might as well be the best. I mean, Dennis find out, let you go, so that we can be together. No, don't say that. That would cost my mother her life. What do you mean? Her medical bills depends on my marriage to Dennis. In fact, everything depends on my marriage to Dennis. That's the deal. Deal? What deal? You know what? Let's just get the food, eat and go home, please. Okay, as you wish. You even got me a birthday cake. Mm -hmm. What is a birthday without a cake? Make a wish. What did you wish for? If I tell you, it won't come true. Hmm. Well, um, I hope your wishes come to pass. Me too. I hope you don't want to go there. You don't want to go there. Oh, please. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's just eat this. Let's just eat this like to civilize people. No one has 
ever done this kind of thing for me before. Not even Dennis. Dennis. That's if he remembers today. Talk more of celebrating me. <laughs> Wait. Sh you mean Dennis has never marked your birthday for you? <laughs> Look, you can see he doesn't love you. So why can't you just... Leave him? No. It's not that easy. My marriage depends on... The deal you had. What is this deal about? You want me to tell you how I met your brother? Well, if the story is not going to win your day... No, it's fine. <sighs> My mother worked for your father. Mm -hmm. And when she retired, she used all her savings to start up a business. But unfortunately, everything burned to ashes and she lost everything. As if that was not enough. She had an accident that caused her a serious hip injury. So we went to meet your father to seek for help. But the moment your father set his eyes on me, he gave my mother a condition that if she allows me to get married to his troublesome son, that he's going to take care of her medical bills as long as it will last. Hmm. And my mom did not even think it twice. She agreed. That was how I found myself, married to a man that was equally forced to marry me. That's why he hates me. He was forced to marry you by my father? Yes. How did you know this? How could you possibly expect me to marry that thing? That low life waiting outside? That low life is your key to becoming the chief director of the Dance Oil and Gas Company. Maybe you don't know. But if you refuse to marry her and give me a grandchild, then you will leave me with no choice but to appoint your brother as the chief director of this oil and gas. You want to give that bastard my birthright? Wash your mouth, Dennis. Wash your mouth. You can't do that. I am the rightful son and the heir to that position. Oh, then the ball is in your gut. It's either you marry the girl and you have three years max to give me a grandchild or the position goes to your brother. He couldn't stand losing the company to you. That's why he married me. Hmm. That's where my mystery began. He wouldn't come home for weeks. He brings, he brings in different women to the house. And when I complain, he will beat me black and blue. Is that why you take the birth control pills? No. I started taking the birth control pills when I heard this conversation with his girlfriend on phone. <sighs> listen, babe. Listen, just, just listen to me. Okay? I'm not in love with this girl. And you have to believe me. The reason I married her is because my father forced her on me. He wants a grandchild and I'm going to give it to him. And once that happens, I will accuse that gold digger of infidelity. I kick her out. She and her mother kick her out to the street where they belong. Then you can come in and raise the baby with me. I promise. I love you too. <laughs>
ये He said that? Wow. He said that? Yes. And I decided I will not give him that satisfaction until my mother's medical condition gets better. Until she can walk freely without any more complication. Then I'll make my move. Good. Nobody deserves to be treated like nothing. Especially a girl like you, Naomi. You deserve better than what you are forced to have. You deserve a man who will see your what and values you for the beautiful soul that you are. Messed up, right? I just had sex with my brothers. Don't say it. Don't change anything. Look, I'm thinking of relocating to Port Harcourt. I have good connections there. You should come with me. Are you insane? Do you want him to kill us? That's if you can get to us first. Please. Come with me. Take me home. Joshua, do you really think you can manage the business in Portacourt all by yourself? <laughs> Dad, I'm a grown man. I, I can run a company. Mm. I still don't think this is a good idea, Dad. And why is that, brother? My name is Dennis. I am not your brother. Boys, enough. Enough. Dad, ever since you mentioned that I will be heading the Portacourt company, he's been picking on me. And would you blame me? Ever since you crawled up from God knows where to come inherit what you and your gold digging mother did not work for, you have been nothing but trouble. Don't you dare mention my mother again. Or what? That's enough. You and your mother are nothing but gold diggers looking to reap where they do not sow. Enough, boys, enough. If not, what kind of a woman will sleep with a married man knowing that he is married? If not, that she is a cheap gold digging slob. I said this enough. Enough! Stop. Stop it! Stop it! Are you okay? Naomi. 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 What is wrong with you? I don't know. You don't know? How are you feeling? Nauseous. Eh? Nauseous?
Okay, let me get the family doctor no, to no, run no, a no, test. No, no, no. no it's, fine, no it's, fine, it's fine. There's, there's no need for that. It's positive. Positive? Yes, sir. Meaning she's pregnant? Exactly. Oh, good news, good news. Congratulations. Thank you. Good news, son. Congratulations. This is no good news, Dad. What are you talking about? Who is the father? Who is the father? It's, it's you. How dare you lie to me? Are you crazy? Is something wrong with you? Don't you dare lie to me. Enough, Dennis, enough. You can't keep treating her this way. So, you are the father. He slept with my wife. Joshua, Dad, what is he talking about? I have no idea. Swear! Swear that you did not sleep with my wife! Dennis, can you exactly tell me what is happening here? Dad. I cannot father a child. You can't father a child? Please, please. Let's blame it on the birth control pills she has been taking. Child control pills. Mama, how, how did you know about the birth control pills? I saw when you threw it into his room that night. Um, Dennis, can you... Can you put me through in all this? Oh, well, you wanted a grandchild and I got busy with her. While doing that, I ran different tests with my doctor here. The last test I ran, she brought the result the morning I was traveling to Port Harcourt and that shows that I am... Good morning, Mr. Daniels. The result came out this morning. What are you doing here? The result came out this morning and I'm traveling to Dubai. I won't be back till a month. So I decided to bring it this morning before I leave. What does he say? It's positive, I'm sorry. I'll take my leave. Have a nice day. I'm important. Yes, he can't father a child. That means you, you, you are. Yes, Dad. I did it. You did? Dad, I'm in love with her. Dennis does not love her. And he, he planned to, to, to get rid of her. How? Dad, Dennis has another woman. Yes. And he planned to frame her up for infidelity. Send her packing after she must have given him a child that he wants to use to, to, to maintain his position in your company. You shouldn't have come here, you bastard. Dennis, Dennis, stop, 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 stop. Dennis, drop this gun, drop this gun. Dennis. Why should I drop it, father? Why, he is the bastard. Hey, they will hurt themselves. Please. 
，你真是。Dennis， Dennis， Dennis， Doctor， Doctor。I'm sorry. We lost him. Which? Love is patient. Love is kind. When your heart is pure, things always have a way of working out in the end. Me, I they wonder why. I do the people that would claim to love, they would be the ones that would hurt us so, so bad. So many times, me, I don't give up on love. Me, I know fit fight this love again. So I am done, done, done. Then you came along and stole my heart. Now I'm dancing to the redeem of your heart. Beating so so bad in a hopeless place where there's no light and all is gone. All we have now is you and I. We found love in a hopeless place where there's no light and all is gone. All we have now is you and I. We found love. The sun will shine again. Behind, yes I can see. 